All right, y'all, I want to take a quick minute to do a little shout out to what I personally feel like is one of the most impressive little witchy, like metaphysical websites that I've seen on the internet in a minute. So a lot of you may remember that my wife used to have this little online business called Cheetah Crystals where her grandmother passed away and she inherited at least an easy $100,000 worth of crystals that her grandmother had collected over the past several decades that, you know, were just stacked in boxes and boxes and boxes. And it was all to make crystal jewelry that <laughs> she never made. She just kind of collected it all and it stacked up until she passed away. And then she passed it on to my wife. And my wife started and ran a pretty successful little online business where she made crystal jewelry and she also made candles too. That was one of the things that my wife would sell on her website. And she eventually ended up getting kind of bored with that and tired of it. And and she shut it down. I wish she wouldn't have because, you know, it, it was pretty successful and we had fun with it, but she lost the passion. But see, during that process, she inspired a friend of hers to start making candles too. And I've gotten a few candles off of her over the past several months and uh, they're pretty neat candles. But at some point here over the past, I don't know, couple of months, this girl done went out and got a business license, put together a really impressive website and stocked it full of really, really impressive products that blew me away. And, and she gave me a little care package. Uh, so I got a couple of candles here that I'm going to show you. This one here is just a basic, there's no real design on this uh, candle here, but on the website, there's, you know, some, some really, really cool, like Jack Skellington and stuff like that. I think there's even like some Chucky and some horror movie themed, like candles and whatnot. But there would be a, a couple of crystals in here, and I'm pretty sure there's some juniper and juniper berries or whatever, something like that. Smells really good. That's going to be burning next to my candle here for the next until it burns out. You all, you all don't see this, but I always have to have a candle burning next to my camera when I'm reading and when I'm sitting in here doing videos, and that's, that's where this is definitely going to sit. Also got this one here. So whenever this one's done, this is going to take its place. This one does have some pretty cool designs on it. It looks kind of Halloween themed. It's got the cool jack-o'-lanterns on it. And, you know, it's got some neat little crystals and whatnot. And, and uh, I think that's sage, I believe so. And that smells pretty, pretty impressive. Here's what blew me away, though. Here's what blew me away. She makes soap. She makes these soaps. And they have a little hidden crystal inside of them. So as you're washing yourself with it, uh, uh, eventually you're going to end up with a little mystery crystal. It's hidden on the inside of it. Isn't that fucking cool, dude? And these things smell amazing, dude. I was like, oh my God. Dude, this is like, I think this one's lavender. This one's lavender. And I got another one here. And this is floral. Kind of smells like flowers. Whew, man, this smell will knock you on your ass, but in a good way. It's not like a bad thing. And again, little mystery crystal hidden in the middle of this. Dude, that's fucking cool as shit, man. And here's another one here. Let's see what's this. Ooh, this looks cool. Hold up. Hold up. Let me open this. Oh. Let's see what we got here. Oh, that's cool. That's awesome. It's like a little tombstone. Ooh. Mm, what is that? That's like, I don't know if that's vanilla or I can't quite tell what that is. That, look at that though. A little R.I.P. Isn't that cool, dude? Isn't that badass? Look, look. And there's more stuff here. I, I just want to say this though. Hang on. Why am I shouting this out? I'm not getting anything out of this. I'm not getting paid for this or nothing like that. I always tell everybody, especially if you want to get on a manifestation path, dude, 
Don't sit around overthinking it and should I do it or what will people think or what if it's not successful, you know, and, and, and I tell everybody, get on the path and start doing something, 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 something. If, if something lights that fire, I don't care what it is. I don't give a damn if it's making candles or making Ninja Turtles out of clay. I don't care what it is. If something lights your soul on fire, give yourself permission to get on the path and start fucking doing it. And that's what she did. And I'm very impressed. Very impressed. I, I can't think of too many people that I've actually seen, you know, just jump in and just start fucking doing it like that. So I'm very, very impressed. I'll link her website down in the description. It's thewickwitch.com. And also, too, she gave me this little, uh, I think this is like a uh, uh, money in abundance um, little mix here. It's got, I'm not 100% sure exactly what everything is in there. There's some crystals, some rice, and some spices and herbs and whatnot in there. That's fucking cool. That's going to sit. That's going to sit back there right behind me just because it looks cool, you know, and oils, dude. Look, lavender oil. Let's see if it smells good. It smells pretty good. And protection spell oil. Now, this looks cool. It looks like it has like some silver in there. Silver and glitter and some herbs and whatnot floating around in there. And money rice. Not 100% sure what money rice is, but that's cool. And anyway, yeah, man, I just wanted to shout this out, man. I'm very impressed. I'm very impressed because that's how you do it, man. And, and, you know, if you give yourself permission to just dump 110% heart, soul, and passion into something, you can create something amazing. And, and that right there is what it's all about. That's what the path is all about. I'm very impressed. This is going to be my permanent <laughs> candle supplier from here on out. You know, it's all natural stuff. It's not those toxic chemicals that you get from the ones at the store. I do like the ones at the store and whatnot, but you know, they're, they're not that good for you. Those smells in the air. They got chemicals and shit that ain't that great. This right here is seriously going to be personally my permanent candle source that that I always have to have a candle burning over there next to my my uh, camera when I'm reading. And, and th this is where I'm going to be getting them. As long as she's still in business and she has her website up, that's where I'm going. So her, her website is linked in the description, thewickwitch.com. She also has an Instagram too. Uh, so definitely go check it out. Just wanted to shout that out. So I hope you all enjoy it. Enjoy the rest of your night.